Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Long time no see, I know. I've been gone over a month now, so I just wanted to come back and do kind of like a chit chat, get ready with me, tell you exactly what's been happening, what I've been doing, what I've been missing, and all of that. So I'm gonna um, get right into the video and, and I'm gonna be doing my makeup and talking to you guys. So yeah, let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so I'm waiting for my cousin to come. So if you guys see me looking up there, it's I'm just checking the cameras because I'm in the room and probably I won't hear her knock. So I'm just waiting for her. She's going to come pick up something. So I guess I'm just going to be doing my makeup. If I forget to tell you guys something that I'm using, I'll probably um, just link it down below or something. So first of all, I'm going to be spraying my face with the Smashbox Primer Water, which is this one right here. It's almost gone. Yep, it doesn't have any more. So I've been gone for a little bit over a month and it's not because I don't want to make videos. I love doing videos. I enjoy making videos. It's just that I've been busy at work and then when I want to film something comes up and I just can't. Also, I film in my room and my room is not big so I can't leave my setup out here i have to like put everything away i have to put everything away and i mean it's it's actually a hassle just to get everything out set up put it back where it belongs and everything so that's mainly why also i haven't been filming because i've just been lazy and it's kind of hard to like actually get everything out put it together put it back away so that's why i haven't really been filming and the times that I want to film, I, I'm just lazy. I'm using the MAC Fix Plus. No. I'm using the MAC Studio, Fli Studio Fix Fluid in the shade NC30. I haven't used it in a while. And I'm not sure if this is actually my shade. But we'll just have to go with it. So yeah, that's why I haven't really been filming videos. I am going to be making another video after this. And this one's exciting because it's going to be a giveaway. So make sure you watch that video if you want to enter that giveaway. It's nothing big, but I just figured I would give you guys something. So actually this color is kind of blending pretty good. Okay, and also, I'm sorry I was like so into it. Also, do you guys see this mirror? It's so pretty. I purchased this mirror. I've been waiting to actually get one of these mirrors. And I just never... I could never get it because it would always sell out like minutes after it launched. So, about two weeks ago, I want to say, um, Jeffrey relaunched his mirrors. And I was able... I was surprised I was able to get one. I was so excited because I've been wanting this pink one. And I was so excited to get it. So now I have it. I have to get used to watch, like looking at this mirror right here because I have a big mirror right here. So I'll, I think I'll look at this big mirror for my foundation and then just for my eyes and stuff. When I want a closer look, I'll use the other one because it's so weird looking at the other one. I'm not used to it. So this foundation looks pretty good. I honestly thought it was going to be darker because I remember using that foundation like, I don't know, like, I, I, hon I honestly can't remember, but I was tanner, but it actually matches pretty good once you blend it all in. So also, I've been busy at work. Um, If you guys don't know, I have a spa, so it's a spa, but I only do nails, so I only go by appointments, so it's not like I'm there every single day. I'm only there when I have appointments, but lately, I've been so busy, and I'm so thankful for that. So I've been busy, and I just get home tired, and I don't want to film because I'm so tired. And like I said, I don't want to take everything out, put it back away, and all that stuff. So yeah, that's about it. I mean... Oh, also, I started keto. I know a lot of people, like me, I used to think it was bad just because I would hear that bad stuff about it. But actually, it's not that bad. It's usually, it's actually the same stuff that you eat all the time except 
no carbs which i'm kind of getting used to it and i kind of like it like i've noticed a lot of changes in my body i've noticed more energy and actually i i i like it i mean it's not bad i know a lot of people would tell me that it was mainly fat you were eating you would get cholesterol this and that but I get it where they're coming from because if you do dirty keto, which is like all the bad fats and stuff, you probably may do get cholesterol. But if you do all the healthy fats like avocado oil, avocado, coconut oil, like all the good fats, like I don't think there's a problem with that. So I think I've been on it. I think it's going to be almost two months. Um, I haven't lost... I haven't lost a lot of weight. I've only lost 12 pounds. I weighed on myself yesterday. I've lost 12 pounds, but I've noticed on my clothes, like they're fitting loose. My stomach looks flatter. And yeah, like I haven't really been noticing, like um, I know a lot of people say they lose like, I don't know, like 25 pounds and stuff. Not me. At first I was like, okay, I don't know how these people are losing. Okay, not 25 pounds. I meant that like in two months. I don't know how people are losing like, um, like one of my friend's husband. He lost, I think it was like 13 pounds in two weeks. And I was like, how? But I know those are guys. Guys look, guys lose weight faster. So we were both like, what are you doing? Because I mean... I think me and her, we've lost the same weight and we've been on it like, I think I've been on it like two weeks after her, but I don't really don't mind the weight because I know that I'm losing inches off my body. So, so yeah, I've been on keto. I really like it. Um, it's not hard. So yeah, that's another thing that I've been doing. My husband actually, he kind of like, he doesn't mind, but he hates that I can't eat everything like he wants to go out and eat and I'm like I can't eat that so he kind of like gets upset because it's hard for me to actually go to a restaurant and actually get something to eat like I can go and just like like modify my what I'm eating so I can go it's just that I don't know it's kind of hard like let's say seafood he wanted to go eat seafood yesterday yeah. and usually a seafood place around here everything is fried it's breaded and fried i can't eat that like i'll get like maybe like a salmon or something but he wanted a shrimp cocktail and i can't eat it because of the ketchup and stuff and yeah so it's kind of hard to go out and eat actually my sister-in-law also she was like you can't eat anything because i don't know where she wanted to go the other day I don't know where she wanted to go and I was like I can't eat that she's like Liz you can't eat anything so yeah that's the only thing about being on keto you can't actually go and eat out a lot like small places like burgers I mean you could but I don't know like I just like mm. like I'll go out if it's like a steak or something because it's easy you just get a steak with veggies and that's about it but yeah so I'm going to be using, you can't really see it because it's bright yellow, this ColourPop palette, which is called Yes Please. I'm going to be using this one on my eyes. So yes, I've been on the keto, like I said, for almost two months. And I am I really like it. You get used to it. And let me tell you guys, I've never drank so much water in my life like I do right now. I'm always thirsty. I drink a lot of water. Um, I can go through a 32 pack of water like less than a week and actually I like it because I feel that my skin is more hydrated and yesterday I was barely saying to myself since I've been on keto I have not gotten a breakout in my face and then yesterday night I get one right here I jinxed myself I got a breakout I was saying that in these two months I have never gotten a breakout in my face like I had never and I was so happy because I was like oh my god my skin is doing so much better but no yesterday night how could you not I get a breakout 
and I was like oh my god I jinxed myself because I was just saying that I have not gotten a breakout so so I got a breakout but basically that's about it I mean it's not that big it'll go away like in a day or two um so yeah we've also had a sad moment um the girl who used to work with us at the spa the one who would do my hair she passed away i'm trying not to cry right now because it really got to me God, i'm trying not to cry it really got to me because i mean she would do my hair um my husband told me um that i didn't know her that well and it's true i didn't really know her i knew her for about I mean I want to say like six months I knew her but she would do my hair she was so nice she was always energetic and I would get to talk to her she would tell me like all her stories and stuff and I would do her nails also so when I found out that she got sick she was already sick so she was already sick but I didn't think I didn't think it was like that bad so when so when i got the text that she had passed away it really got to me because i mean she worked with me and i would do her nails she would do my hair we would talk i don't know like i know my husband says that i didn't know her that well but it just got to me a lot and i was sad and i just kept on thinking about her and i would even have like like dreams about her and yeah so this was about i want to say three four weeks ago but i know she's in a better place right now and that's all that matters like she's not suffering anymore um that's a good thing like i don't like seeing people suffer when they're sick so now i know that she's not going to be suffering anymore so yeah that's another thing that happened so i don't want to talk about it anymore because i'm feeling kind of sentimental so let's just move on and work with our makeup so i already did my top the top of my eyeshadow i think i'm gonna move on to my brows real quick just because i want to see how it's gonna look so as always i'm using the anastasia brow definer and yeah so for videos i don't know like i kind of want to do like a series i know a lot of people have these so i don't want you guys to think that i'm copying other youtubers because a lot of them have them and it's kind of like a color series like where every time you do like a different color like they have like a rainbow they have like a jewels and all that i kind of want to do like a color series which every video I do like a different eye color of makeup I don't know if you guys are interested let me know down below also I want to mention um, another thing that why I haven't been actually filming so I also think about filming videos because I have I think like 312 subscribers which is a lot to me and um and when I see like who sees my videos and stuff it's like not even half of that it's like like my last video that I have it's like only like less than 10 views or something like that that's another thing that I have been like struggling with not struggling with but it's kind of like sad to see that i have like 300 subscribers and not even half of them are watching my videos which makes me think that they only subscribed for giveaways and i don't think i'm the only one who thinks that i know a lot of people small youtubers like me they they also get that like they give a, they do a giveaway and you get like 100 subscribers and then you don't see them watch your videos so that's about no 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 go over there and you don't see them and they don't see your videos they just subscribe to you because of the giveaway so that i don't think that's good 
if you are not going to see someone's channel or watch their videos so why subscribe just for the giveaway i don't think that's nice but that's just my opinion like i don't i don't know like maybe they do want to watch my channel they just don't have time or they just subscribe for the giveaway who knows but yeah that's another thing that i have also been like <clears throat> dealing like not dealing with but it's kind of sad to see like people subscribe to you and not look at your videos at all okay my cousin said she was gonna be here like in an hour and it's been more than an hour i think and she's not here yet so i think i'm gonna put on should i put on my eyelashes at last no let me just put them on right now and then just continue with my face so i'm gonna be just using lashes which these are just like a simple lash i get these off ebay they come like in a pack of five and they're so easy to apply and actually i use them more than three times so they do last and they just look like these right here this is an old pair i think i've used these like i don't know like maybe three four times but they're still good so as long as they don't look all ugly and stuff I'll still use them so yes like I was saying I'm going to be doing another giveaway on my next video like I said it's nothing big but I just figured I would um, let you guys know and I'm gonna give you a spoil <laughs> alert um, it's brushes I do have a Morphe subscription box bag or whatever it's called and i do get a lot of brushes every month so i'm not going to use all of them so i just figured i would give some to you that i'm not using because since i'm not using them i why would i want them here just laying in my vanity so i just figured i would do a beginners must have brushes like a set of brushes that you do need if you're a beginner and you're wondering what kind, what kind of brushes you should get I'm gonna do that video and I'm also going to be giving away um, I think they're like I don't know how many brushes like 10 brushes or something I can't really remember so I'm gonna be doing that video after this one right here so yeah make sure you guys stick around and look for that okay I got one lash on see how natural it looks right now I'm gonna wait till it dries and then just curl it and if you guys are wondering what glue I use I used to use the white one like the, the one that dries clear but then I've noticed that it leaves like a shiny layer on the lash so I've been using the black one the dual black one and I know they came out with a new one which I think it dries like instantly or something like that this one you have to wait till it gets tacky so it can stick to your eye otherwise it's going to move everywhere and it's going to be hard for you to apply the lash so you have to literally like blow on it like just wave it or whatever because if you apply it right away it's going to slide everywhere and it's going to be a complete mess <gasps> oh my god i messed it up i got glue all over my eye all over my eyeshadow. Hi. You're recording? Yeah. We need to make one, me and you. Later. Not later today, but like later. What's you wanna going? come say hi? Who's going to say? Working. How do I even get in there? <laughs> Jump the bed. Hi. <laughs> really? <laughs> Look at my mirror. Dude, it's so pretty. I messed up my eyelash. I'm gonna wait till it dries. Pretty right now or like because I can't? No, oh. just oh, okay. like right now. So another tip that I want to give. It's so <laughs> weird like me talking like and you're here. Another tip that I want to give. If you get glue all over your eyelid like I did right here. Don't mess with it. Just wait till it dries and then it'll just come off like super easy. So yeah. You're gonna go work? I like it. I have to go for a little bit. I'm going to be applying eyeliner and you guys know my favorite eyeliner, Sephora Cool Liner in the shade Cocoa. It's my sister-in-law's favorite eyeliner as well, I think. Yep. <laughs> she doesn't want to come over here because she can't get over here. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I like your sandals. I got them at Home Goods. You did? Mm-hmm. We haven't gone shopping. 
<laughs> so my sister-in-law, now that she's here, she was out of town. Forever. And I forever. I feel like forever. And I've been waiting for her because... She misses me. We haven't had sister-in-law, sister-in-law <laughs> time. And usually when I go shopping or we go out, we go out together. So I've been waiting for her to come back. Maybe have lunch or something. Yeah. You can't eat no. anything. Cat. Look at the baby. Hey, Look hey. At the babies. Hey, go over there. Hold on, let me All go. dogs, get out. Hold oh on. my God. Fluffy. <laughs> Mom doesn't go to school tomorrow. I have an event on Saturday, and then I'm off on Sunday, and then I leave on Monday. Dude, I think I have to leave to the airport like at 3.30 in the morning. I know. It's a super long day. For bronzer, I'm going to be using this Morphe one. I don't have that one. Oh, that is so pretty. It's so pretty. I'm going to be using this one. It's in the shade Icon. I'm doing like a chit chat. Get ready with me. So. I like it. And my next video is going to be a giveaway. Uh, Brushes. Like Guys, she makes me log in to do it too. Don't think I get any special treatment. <laughs> I wouldn't let her anyways. It's called integrity. Dude, I like that color. Get the chest. It's like an orangey. Which one? Your eyeshadow. Oh, it's this palette. Color pop. So I'm just applying a little bit of bronzer. I really don't want a lot of bronzer. And I'm going to be contouring with the Anastasia, as always. You're going to go work? Oh, okay, okay. I don't know how long, but the way that goes, that's okay. Okay. I don't think I should What um, video? Are you still thinking of that other one of like, what's in my mouth video? No. Oh. We were planning on doing a what's in my mouth video. I know it sounds kind of gross, <laughs> but, um,. It was the one where she picks candies or food or whatever, and I pick some too. And we have to be blindfolded, and you have to guess what it is. But since I can't eat candy anymore, I can't do it. Oh. Like, can we do, like, healthy stuff? Like granola bars? I can't have granola bars. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. I'm going to be using my blush palette by Morphe. I'm just going to be doing this color right here. Wait, that's not unapologetic. It's giving the nuance. No, it's unapologetic. Yeah, that's it. Hi, you're getting to know your colors? Dude, yeah. I didn't even get to do my makeup over there. I kept getting the pain in my skin. It kept hurting so bad. I said myself home twice. Okay, so now that this lash glue is a little bit dry, I you just want to grab some tweezers and then just kind of like rub it and it's going to go away. That's all you have to do? Uh-huh. So you have to let it dry first. Oh my gosh, dude, I used to take everything off and do <laughs> Okay, bye people. I'll see you later. Okay. You want me to lock the dogs out so that they... No, because they weren't here until Fluffy came in. I feel it. It's getting, like, swollen. Ah. Okay, just be careful because I just poked my eye. Um, it's like a I'm just going to leave it on like that for now. I know I messed it up, but I poked my eye. Okay, all I'm left to do is just apply my highlighter and my lipstick. So for highlighter, I'm going to be using the Anastasia right here. I haven't been using this one. I've been using the actual palette. So I just figured I will use this one right now. And oh my god, it's so pretty. So yeah, like I was saying, I wanted to do um, more videos. If you guys have suggestions of what I should film or you guys want me to see. I mean, you guys want me to film something. Like, I also wanted to do like a bridal makeup. I think that would be so cool. Um, I haven't done one of those in this channel, so I just wanted to do that. So, maybe I'll do that later. I'm going to be spraying my face first. 
before I apply my lipstick because I've noticed when I apply the setting spray after my lipstick if it's a liquid lipstick I feel like it gets kind of like tacky so that's why I have not been doing that so I'm just gonna be wiping away um, this foundation and powder that I have on my lips and then I'm gonna be using the Kylie lip liner which I need to sharpen so I'm gonna be applying the Kylie dirty peach Just so I can um, line my lips. And I bought my first Jeffree Star liquid lipstick. And this is in the shade Calabasas. So it looks like this. I don't know if it's going to go with this shadow. Who cares? We're still going to wear it. Oh my god, this is such a pretty shade. So... Yeah. It doesn't go with this shadow, but I want to wear it, so I don't care. Yeah, this is a little bit more pink. It does not go with this shadow. So what I'm going to do, I think this shadow had like a pinky shade, kind of like this one. I think I'm going to be adding more of that in here. Is it pink? No, I feel like it's more like an orangey. I'm just going to be adding a little bit here. Okay, never mind. This lipstick does not go with this shadow. So I wanna just wipe it away. I'm gonna be using Dose of Colors Campfire. This is a little bit more like this color right here. So yeah. So that is it. I finished my makeup look. What do you guys think? Um, I really like it. It's, oh my god, it's so glowy. So, yeah, this is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys want to see more videos or you have any suggestions, please let me know on the comments down below what kind of videos you guys would like to see. That would really be so helpful. And like I said, I'm going to be doing a giveaway on my next video. So just stick out for that. Watch out. If you guys want to click that bell to get notified every time I upload videos. That way you won't miss any videos that I upload. And you get to see my next video, which was which is a giveaway. So other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And it was nice coming back and talking to you guys. And if I bored you, I'm sorry. And yeah, that's it for this video. Please make sure you subscribe to my channel. And follow me on my Instagram and Twitter and all the other platforms. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. Until next time, I'll see you guys soon. Bye.